Frequently, we spotlight women in business on Jackson 24-7. Recently, a Jackson woman has started a new business as a personal assistant. In short, if you need things done, she'll get them done. Lisa Adkins is here to tell us all about it. Lisa, thank you so much for joining me today. Thank you for having me. So you started a personal assistant business. I did. Um, we've had women who have started a variety of businesses. What exactly is a personal assist assistant, and how did you get the idea for that business? I got the idea because I graduated from Union when I was 45 in 2005, and I have been extremely successful in healthcare. Okay. And what I have found is that there are a lot of people who do not have anyone. Uh, they may not have a spouse or a husband, or they may be a single mother, sure. and they get in trouble and they need help, and they have no one. And actually, I just saw the need was just intensifying that we live in such a stressful time mm -hmm. and so more, so many people are busy and they don't have anybody yes, and they, they get in some really uncomfortable positions uh, they may have surgery or i got sick two years ago and i had no family here mm. my daughter had a baby and her baby was very sick in knoxville wow. and she didn't have any help so i just became burdened that i was going to be determined to open up this business I run errands, I do all kinds of things, anything that someone might need to help make their life easier or take a burden off of them. Sure, sure. How did you market your business for this, since this isn't something that many people know of as a possibility? Right. I go to the first trigger points where people may have needs, which okay. would be assisted livings, uh, grocery stores. I've been to Kroger, I've been mm. to Grubs, they have my cards there. Um, I also uh, in social uh, media sure. on Facebook and I have a Facebook page I'm building a website okay. and I'm doing co-starters at the co where I'm learning about new businesses sure mm -hmm. okay so tell us a little bit uh, you touched on this a little bit but tell us some more about jobs that you do as a personal assistant mm -hmm. like with your clients um, right. is it someone that you know is it more of a personal relationship uh, what is that like? It's both. Okay. It's really shocking. It's it's. I've only been in this business for four months, but people in Jackson, I think, are starting to figure out what I'm doing. And maybe it's because I've been in healthcare for so long, and sure. I have a lot of connections. Sure. But I think um, one of my ex most exciting was a man called me and needed help. He was lived in an outlying community. He had to come to Jackson. Mm -hmm to buy medical supplies, wow. such as the pens and pads and that kind of thing. It is what it is. And he had to, you know, close his business, had to drive over. Mm -hmm. So there is a real need for people to just help with general things. They have sure. no family here. Certainly. I also um, assist with some transportation. Okay. It's been very rewarding. How is that senior going to get to the dentist right. when you don't have any vacation days left mm -hmm. or holiday time left? And so I do that. Um, someone called me a week ago and said, would you take five dozen or four dozen cupcakes and deliver them to people? Sure. They were very successful uh, and did not have time to do that, but wanted to thank people in their lives. And I thought, I'm delivering happy today. That is really exciting. Yeah. So it kind of... Um, the spectrum is kind of uh, broad. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. So how do you handle this kind of work as a necessarily on needed basis? Yes. Um, do you contract for a day or for two a week or how does that work scheduling wise? It varies. Wise? Okay. It varies. Uh, I actually look at the need and we sit down and customize a plan for what the need is because that's why I said personal assistant, you're hourly because you may just need me one time. Sure. You may need me every other week. You may need me once a month for a while. You may have surgery and just need someone for a month. So it's really a customized package. Sure. And I just meet with them and, and we go over the fees. So how can people contact you to find out more about your service? They can call me at 731-234-0533. Uh, I am building a website and I do have social media. Okay. It's Lisa Adkins PA is my Facebook page. Perfect. Thank you so much, Lisa, for being with us. Thank you for having me. We'll find out more if we're going to make it make a turn back to fall temperatures for the weekend. Rachel Pratt will have a final look at the weather right after these messages.